I'm Corbett Wall with DV Auction here with a three minute cattle market update for Wednesday May the 11th brought to you in part by the American Simmental Association you know the most durable and fertile female is a crossbred see what sim genetics can do for you go to simmental.org boy the currentness that has uh, suddenly found its way into the cattle feeding industry has really lent a lot of support and we've seen it the last week and and continuing into this week really nice and and uh, all of a sudden everybody's attitudes are just a whole lot better uh, your live cattle on the June contract for Monday was up two dollars and fifty seven cents after all the big gains that we saw last week Tuesday it uh, took a breath there and was down just two cents but end of the day on Tuesday at 123.27. Feeder cattle on the May contract for Monday was up 342. Tuesday uh, corrected a little bit, down 60 cents, but end of the day on Tuesday at 150.20, which is trading at a huge uh, premium to what the current cash market is. Look at your CME feeder cattle index, uh, is 144.23, so you know that's a good six dollars right there. Your real-time index is right in line with CME index at 144.17. But uh, corn and, and beans were both up real big on Tuesday. Of course, they were down some on Monday, but uh, uh, that could cause people to look around a little bit here in the middle of the week. But uh, corn was up 10 cents on Tuesday after being down 8 on Monday, and beans were up over 57 cents on Tuesday which uh, it, it'll make people pay attention here in the middle of the week. Your weighted averages on your uh, feedlot trade last week on a huge volume of 100,500 head. Uh, compare that to the same week a year ago of 53,100 head. But uh, your, uh, your weighted average price on, on a live steer was 126.59, which was up $2.80 from the previous week. Uh, your dress finally made some ground up and, and it needed to because it was falling way behind there. But your uh, dress steer on weighted average was $198.66, up $4.50. But uh, already this week, just on the first two days of trading, we've seen uh, box beef cutout values surge. Uh, we're going to see a big week for box beef values uh, because uh, we had a big clearance of, of uh, some supplies, a big volume uh, last week and uh, finally some of those uh, wholesalers got in there and then bought some of the product up at the lower price levels and now the Packers are going to make these guys that are filling in going into the big holiday season and, and going into this uh, grilling weather that we're all of a sudden getting coast to coast uh, they're going to make these guys pay but uh, we're going to have shorter volume but we're really seeing the prices surge and and all this uh, following following the big kills that we've seen two weeks of 590,000 there and uh, this week uh, not expecting to be quite that big but still pretty good size your cash feeder markets in Oklahoma City at 7700 on Monday four to ten dollars higher which was a lot more than what I thought I thought we might see three to five but uh, it's just everything working together is giving everybody a lot more uh, bullishness and uh, and we're really seeing it a bunch on these uh, on these feeder cattle markets really because uh, the the cash feeder cattle market is, is lagging way behind what the board's quoting but uh, Joplin had only 3700 on Monday there but their feeder cattle were four to six dollars higher calves uh, some of the heifer calves up to twelve dollars higher so a big surge there some actual quotes there on uh, cattle market central uh, Phillips South Dakota on Tuesday at two o'clock in the afternoon had a big load of 726 pound steers bring 159.50 and you think oh man that's a big price but uh, you know that's way up there in the Dakotas and some crazy farmer feeder probably did it or but uh, these things are really coming up you look at Monday at 11:30, Joplin had a kind of a short load of 734 pound steers bring 156 and that's that's not very far behind but uh, that's three minutes we'll talk to you on Friday